How to connect to a local Hyper-V virtual machine via SSH. What I have. Windows 8.1 Professional Edition. What I want. To simulate a circumstance, connect a remote Linux system using SSH. What I do. Install CentOS 6.4 x64 under the built-in Hyper-V. It works like a charm. What is the question? How to connect to this Hyper-V CentOS via terminal by SSH? The simplest solution is to enable a bridged connection. You can find here how to do that. Once you have done this, and started your VM, it will appear on your LAN with an IP just like your host. Then you can SSH into it by means of or whatever you use on Windows, PuTTY I presume. Step-by-step -step instructions for folks who might stumble into this. Guest in GT, Linux on Hyper-V. Host in GT, your OS, Windows August 10th, 2011. Make sure the guest, Linux, can access the internet, using default switch in the Hyper-V manager is the easiest. On guest, install NetTools and open SSH server. A, dollar sudo app get install NetTools B. Dollar sudo apt get install y open server. Edit configuration file for open after it's installed. Nano slash etc slash ssh slash ssh underscore config or by slash etc slash ssh slash ssh underscore config. By editor is generally available by default. You might need to install nano if you are not comfortable with by. Find and uncomment. Hashtag password authentication yes. So it looks like. Password authentication yes. Save the file. Reload SSH after these changes. A. Pseudo system to disable SSH B. Pseudo system to enable SSH if above commands are not working, also try these. Pseudo system to stop SSH. Pseudo system to start SSH. Ensure SSH is running, hash system plus status SSH now you can peacefully move ahead. On guest, find its IP from the terminal. Use A, IP address, or B, IP address, grep IF0C. Username is your Linux username, and password is your Linux login password. On the host machine, use PowerShell to connect directly to the guest, or use programs like PuTTY. I personally prefer PowerShell. Make sure the Hyper-V is running. E.g. host name, Linux username, IP, 172.154.123.321, C number 7, password, Linux password PowerShell. SSH Linux username 172.154.123.321 type Linux password. Putty. Same, just input the IP address in the host name and press enter. Type password into the terminal and you should be in there too. I'm going to chime in because the given answer only covers the use case where you want your VM to also be exposed to the internet, and is also more work than necessary. If you want to get this working on a virtual internal network, set up the virtual switch's internal network and apply it to the VM. In the Hyper-V Manager, under the Networking tab, you should see the IP6 addresses associated with the VM. Adjust the width of the columns if necessary or mouse over to reveal the far right IP6 address, probably starts with FE80.
Connect to this IP address using your software of choice. In the case of the external network, you should see the IP4 address it is using on the network tab and should be able to connect to that. Solution that I use to SSH into VMS with default switch, dynamic internal IP, with one command. Enable static MAC address in the VM, in Hyper-V Manager go to VM Settings and GT, Network Adapter and GT, Advanced Features and GT, MAC Address and GT, Static. In PowerShell add the following to $Profile file, for example open with, Notepad $Profile. Change user to your guest system user and o o o o o o o o o o o o to your static MAC address specified in the first step. Additionally, to make sure the above script is executed during shell startup, appropriate execution policy should be set. One way is to execute the following as administrator. After that you should be able to SSH into your guest VM by executing guest VM in PowerShell.